The solar eclipse is now just days away and the city of Niagara Falls is preparing for as many as 1 million people to come out and witness the rare celestial event on Monday. As Eric Viano reports, businesses are preparing for the crowds as well as people coming from far and wide. The streets of Niagara Falls may not be too busy right now, but many have already started showing up in anticipation of the solar eclipse. Some from far away. We're from Black Falls, Alberta. This will be the second solar eclipse we've traveled to see. We're from Virginia. I had planned to come up here for to see Niagara Falls when I turned 30, but I figured mine as well come this year on my 29th because of the solar eclipse. One man says that he traveled to see the last solar eclipse and says it was a life-changing experience. You can understand why people used to get freaked out by that before we understood space because just the chill that you get when everything starts to get dark, it gets quiet and you just see that change in the uh, just the whole atmosphere. It's just really chilling. You know, there's something about it, it makes you feel very human, I guess. Now, if you do want to witness the eclipse yourself, you're going to want to get your hands on a pair of these glasses right here. They do look like 3D glasses from the early 2000s, but they're actually just meant to protect your eyes from the sun while the eclipse is happening. Now, I spoke with a business owner in the Niagara Falls area who is selling these glasses, preparing people for the big day on Monday. But he says that he's preparing his workers and his shop for that day as well, because Niagara Falls is expected to get upwards of one million million people. The mayor called me. He said, Pramod, this is what's happening. I said, are you sure? Yeah. So his father told me, get the glasses, you know. Pramod Goyal has owned Falls View Market for 12 years and remembers the last massive event in Niagara Falls when Nick Willenda tight roped across the falls in 2012. There were around 50,000 people in the falls then. Goyal says he's prepared for Monday to be much, much busier. It will be jammed here. I told my manager, my general manager, he said, I said, make sure you got one extra person. I won't be coming. So we got normally two to three. We will have four to five. The city has started setting up porta potties and a stage for live music ahead of Monday. In the Niagara region, the eclipse starts at 2.04 p.m. and ends at 4.23. At 3.18 p.m., the moon will cover 100% of the sun. Here in Niagara Falls, that will last for 3 minutes and 32 seconds. Eric Vieno, CHCH News, Niagara Falls.